Hi everybody, it's Jody here and welcome to The Nook. So today we are going to do my Ipsy bag unboxing for July and August. We got a two for today, two for one. Um, So I've started only opening these once every couple months and opening up two at a time just because I felt like my channel was inundated with just like all these monthly subscription unbagging. So that's how we're doing it folks. So let's start with July. Oh, there's, I feel things. I feel more than one things. Oh, there is more than one thing. <laughs> All the things. Okay, so July's theme was Ipsy. Hot summer nights. Ooh, sexy. Anyways. Oh, look at the bag. Oh, okay. Well, I got a brush. I'm always down for a brush. Whoa, this is stiff as, stiff as all stiff can be. Who is this from? Vasante. The really cool thing about it being from Visante is Visante, I believe, is a Canadian company. I've received some lipsticks and stuff from them in the past, but I haven't tried their brushes yet. So this is really, really, really dense. A little, a little stiffer than anything I have of this size. So that is Coolio. The bag, yo. I am going to be so excited about this because it's shiny. This is the back, but look at the front with little candies and sparkles. Well, the sparkle, but like iridescence. Holy crap. I feel like Elton John would be into this bag. <laughs> That's horrible to say, but he was like into the disco. That's what I'm saying. Elton John would love this bag. I think so. I think he probably has sunglasses that almost look like that. These are awesome. I love it. I don't... Okay, I'm going to shut up move on. Uh, so we got the brush. That's product number one. We usually get about four or five products in here. So I got one that I've had a lot of times before. It's the Embryo Least Latte Cream Concentrate. It's a multifunctioning nourishing lotion. I've tried it. It's okay. It's not my favorite. It looks like this. It's just fine. There's nothing wrong with it. I got a girlfriend from work who really likes it, so I'll pass it on to her. She'll be more than happy. What else do we have? We have a big box here from Trust Fund Beauty. I think does nail polish. Oh, yes, they do nail polish. What color is this? No filter. So this is like a super pinky nude. It's coming up like in the viewfinder. It looks a little bit more brown and tan, but it does have some mauve pink undertones. You guys know I don't paint my own nails, so that will be passing it on. Holy crap. This is not this is not going well for this month. Ooh, what else have we got? We have a J Cat. Beauty Perfecting Dual Brow Pencil. So it's going to expose spoolie. Should it have a lid? No, yeah, there's no lid in there, so whatever. It's got an exposed spoolie. It feels okay. And then this is in a brow pencil in brown. I don't know what color it is. I'm going to say it's dark, dark brown, so it may work. I have a few pencils on the go right now, so I probably won't be opening that soon. But I know a few YouTubers that swear by J-Cat Beauty, so I'm definitely going to hang on to that and try. And the last thing for the month of July is Meet Matrimony. Aww. I like these. Oh my god, look at this color. Matt Miskowski. That is... It's a dustier purple than I thought it was going to be in the pan. Like, I mean, look how rich and dark that looks. And then look at the swatch. It's a little lighter than I thought it would be, and it's not quite as pigmented as most of the shadows and things that I have gotten from the Balm. I don't know if it has to do with it's a single package or whatever, because usually I really like Balm eyeshadows, but I'm going to have to try it out. I think that'd be a really, really, really nice kind of crease color or something. So anyways, that was the bag. Oh, 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 stay in love. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. That's what I think of. I feel like we should all, like, get extra large hair, and we should all dip ourselves in, like, gold, shiny whatever, slap on our roller skates, and have a disco party. I know. I'm a weirdo. So that was July. Now we're into August. August is the, August is a fatty. What do we got in here? Okay. So there's a card. So for the month of August, it was a sugar highness. Oh, how cute. All right, moving right along. Oh, here's the bag. Ooh, I like the shape of the bag. So the back is pure white. The front has this lady doing makeup kind of stuff. Big box. Ugh, nail polish. Uh, Ciate London paint pot. And this is in the color Spinning Teacup. It's a very cute color. It's an odd color for them. It, it 
tell me if I'm wrong, but this is an odd color for them to send out in August when we're just about to start the fall season. This looks like an Easter egg. It's pretty. I'll be passing it on. You guys know the nails. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, what else we got in here? We have a Rodial. I think that's how you say it. Rodial Smoky Eye Pan. It looks like this. It's pretty good. It's nice. Eyeliner is always useful. I got this big thing. What's this big thing? Uh, Madam C.J. Walker Beauty Culture Smoothing Brassica Seeds and Shea Oils. I said that so wrong. Silkening Blowout Cream. Oh my god, is this for your hair? I gotta smell this. What does this smell like? Oh, that smells... No, no. Okay, I'm, I know it's a cream for your hair, but I'm doing this because I, I need to smell it. I need to know. <laughs> it has this weird... Okay, it smells like... Like, you can smell, like, sort of the ingredients, the components, the... But it has this sort of, like, underhint smell. Now, this is going to sound really weird of, like, a carnival. Like, you can almost kind of smell cotton candy in the distance. Like, somebody's over you know doing barbecue stuff I it's hard to explain but it literally this is like Coney Island in a bottle yeah there's definitely some under hints of cotton candy in this oh, I think I need to blow my hair out right now go wet it and blow it out <laughs> all right what else we got in here we have got okay I'm super excited about this because I have so many mascaras on the go and I really wanted to try this one but um I couldn't justify buying another one to open it up, but I have a sample of the Tarte Tartist. Oh, I've heard so much about this. This is, I don't get very excited about mascaras. I kind of have my ride or dies. This is the wand. Synthetic bristles, so not everybody's into that. It doesn't, like for a mascara, it doesn't have an overly janky smell. I could pop that on real tight because I can't wait to try this. I can't wait to try it. The last thing. What is this? The box is a little janky, but, uh, Beauty Basics three-tone bronzers. I don't think I've ever even heard of Beauty Basics. Have I been living under a rock or something? Have you guys heard of it? I don't know. I don't know. Janky box. Uh, comes like this. Why? <laughs> it looks like that. So it's got three, I guess like a mahogany kind of brown, and it's got like kind of a milk chocolate, and then it's got kind of this pinky on the side. So I'm guessing the whole idea of this bad boy is to kind of swirl it together. Holy crap, that's shiny, but it's not so shiny that it's unusable. That's actually really not bad. Um, yeah, I'm gonna try it. Doesn't smell any like anything. All right, guys, well, that's it. We have done the unbagging of the Ipsy bag for the month of July and August 2016. If you guys want to know my thoughts on any of the items or samples that I got here, let me know in the comments down below. I will be sure to respond and let you know. Other than that, if you enjoyed this video, enjoyed me, like Ipsy, give us a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed to my channel already, it would be greatly appreciated if you hit that subscribe button. We would love to have you here. And other than that, thank you so much for stopping by. I will see you all next time. Hi everybody, it's Jody here. Jazz hands. Jazz hands. Okay. Try this again.